Um, what's going on everybody? So, the follow up on my last video that I posted hours ago this this morning, 5.30 a.m. So, um, I'm just gonna talk about this just a little bit more. So, Sledgehammer Games have developed three Call of Duties with Michael Condry and Glenn Schofield as studio heads. They co-developed Call of Duty by the Warfare 3 with Infinity War in 2011. They released their first solo developed title in 2014 with Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. Their latest release, Call of Duty World War II, went on to be the best selling Call of Duty title on current generation consoles. Really? I mean, I can believe it considering people want boots on the ground and all that stuff. I, 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 can, I can believe it. I can definitely believe it. Well, I'm gonna be the nice one here. Hopefully things go well for him. Both of those dudes. Uh, I think they did Call of Duty good in certain aspects. For the better. Some for the bad. Um, Yeah, that's about it. That's all I really gotta say. Hopefully this new dude that's the head of the World War II game. We have a bunch of months left. But like I was saying, hopefully this guy can pull through and, you know, get most of the fans what they want. We want better sprint on time, better score streaks. A lot of us want uh, nerfs to the requisition. I'm one of those people, but some people don't want it nerfed. But I do. I think you should at least have to earn your score streaks. Uh, that's just my opinion. So I think you should just earn your score streaks a little I think this is to be a little higher to get the score streaks, you know, because even even I can do it. I mean, it's not really hard to get 24 kills in a domination match and then wait around almost the end of the match, put out paratroopers, full turret gunner, and all that stuff, and then bam, you win. No, I don't think that's fair, but this is just one man's opinion. So... Oh man, I really hope World War II gets out of this hole because as of right now, there is absolutely nothing for me to do. I, I'm bored of it. There's nothing for me to do. I would play this game more if people would, oh man, oh my God, people camp so much in this game. We have to stop blaming the game for these people camping, bro. We have to stop. It's the people. They camp hella hard. Why? I don't know why. Because you can clearly run around in this game and get kills. And this weapon is ass. I'm always getting hit markers with that. But yeah, seriously. Uh, there's just too many campers in this game for me, man. I, I, I can't do it. I just can't, I can't do it no more. They, they ruined the game for me. I love the game. I really do. I, just like a lot of people do. But there's just certain things that just pushes you away. I, I, I can deal with the I can deal with the sniper rifles that's killing me every goddamn second. I can deal with that. I can deal with the goddamn fire shotguns that kills me in every goddamn match. But for them to sit in the corner, and somehow, some way, I always look the wrong way. Every time it fails for me to never look the right way I always if somebody's on the left side I always go to the right side and look that way and get killed from, from my back they can't with shotguns I should I should record all the times people kill me constantly back to back in the corner it, it, it's driving me away the only reason I even get on Call of Duty right now is to do my contracts get my supply drops and dip it's never been like this before. These players, you guys are gonna have to stop playing like little bitches sometimes, man. For real. You guys play like you just got the game. I see massive prestigious 200 plus sitting in corners with a shotgun. Bro, if you don't. Woo, let me get up out of here, man. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um. <sighs> people camping on gun game. I'm out.